Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Very very good afternoon to everyone and welcome everyone to this spoken English class. The aim of this course is to have fluency in English. This is our 10 days course. Today's class will be on day 8. After completing the course, teachers will be able to speak English with the students, with the guardians, with the teachers, principal, and with all. What I can't but say, many, many thanks and my heart is felicitations to Dr. Alamir Hussain, Honorable Principal of his esteemed institute, Rajarba Krishna School and College. Very soon, Rajarba Krishna School and College is going to start English medium section. And that will be from 2021. I mean, 2021 will be session, new session for English medium section. So dear learners, let's start today's class. Spoken English, day eight, part one, daily conversation. In part one, we will learn some important daily conversation. Step 44, 42, in the last class, we learned up to 41. Today, we will start from step 42. And the title of step 42, can you tell me the time? One conversation will be between A and B. A, excuse me, can you tell me the time please? B, yes, of course, it's five o'clock. A, thank you. B, no problem. It's a little conversation, but very much important. Dear learners, let's go forward. Step 43. Can I help you? Or buying a cooler? I mean, can I help you or buying a pullover? Better to give one title, buying a pullover. Conversation will be between A and B. A, can I help you? B, yes, I'm looking for a pullover. A, what size are you? B, I am an extra large. A, how about this one? B, yes, that's nice. Can I try it on? A, certainly. There's the changing rooms over there. B, thank you. A, how does it fit? B, it's too large. Do you have a large? A, yes, here you are. B, thank you. I will have it, please. Dear learners, please copy this. I'm going forward. The rest portion of 43. A, okay. How would you like to pay? B, do you accept credit cards? A, yes, we do. Visa, MasterCard, and American Express. B, okay. Where's my Visa card? A, thank you. Have a nice day. B, thank you. Goodbye. 
have a nice day here i have said this with wonder that's why i have used sign of exclamation here i will practice this conversation with reshmanas reshmanas hello sir hello you will, yes you will play the role of a and i will play the role of b okay okay sir i start can i help you yes i am looking for a pull up What size are you? Ah, my extra large. How about this one? Yes, that's nice. Can I try it on? Certainly. There is the changing rooms over there. Thank you. How does it fit? It's too large. Do you have a large? How does it fit? Yes, here, here you are. Thank you. I will have it, please. Okay, how do you like to pay? Do you accept credit cards? Yes, we do. Visa, Visa. MasterCard and American Express. Okay, here is my Visa card. Thank you. Have a nice day. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye. Dear learners, step 45. And the title of step 45 asking for directions. Conversation is between A and B. A, excuse me, is there a shopping mall near here? B, yes, there's one near here. A, how do I get there? B, at the traffic lights. Take the first left and go straight on. It's on the left. A, is it far? B, not really. A, thank you. B, don't mention it. I will practice this conversation with Shor Mr. Das. You will play the role of A and I will play the role of B. Start. Yes, sir. Okay. Excuse me, is there a shopping mall near here? Yes, there's one near here. How do I get there? At the traffic lights. Take the first left and go straight on. It's on the left. Is it far? Not really. Thank you. Don't mention it. Okay. it will be 44 and this will be 45 step 44 asking for directions this title will be belong to step 44 and asking for directions another little conversation this conversation will be belong to 45 step 45 a excuse me is there a bank near here b yes there is a bank on the corner a thank you b you are welcome tamanna i will practice this conversation with you You will play the role okay, of A sir. and I will play the role of B. Okay, <clears throat> start. Yes, sir. Excuse me, is there a bank near here? 
Yes, there is a bank on the corner. Thank you. Well, welcome. Another conversation. This conversation belongs to step 46. And the title of step 46, ordering a meal. Conversation is between A and B. I will play, I mean, I will practice this conversation with Reshma Nas. You will play the role of A. Okay, fine. I will play the role of A and you will play the role of B. Okay, sir. Yes, A, Reshma Nas. Can you follow yes, me? Sir. Okay, all right. Yes, sir. I will play the role of A. Can I see a menu, please? Certainly. Here you are. Thank you. What's today's special? Grilled chicken and cheese on rye. That sounds nice. I will have that. Would you like something to drink? Yeah, I would like a lemonade. Thank you. Here you are. Enjoy your meal. Thank you. Can I get you anything else? No, thanks. I would like the bill, please. That's the 250 taka only. Here you are. Keep the change. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye. Okay. Bye. That means conversation is between A and B. A, can I see a menu please? B, certainly. Here you are. A, thank you. What's today's special? B, grilled chicken and cheese on rice. A, that sounds nice. I will have that. B, would you like something to drink? A, yes. I would like a lemonade. Lemonade, I mean, all soft drinks belong to lemonade. Thank you. Here you are. Enjoy your meal. Enjoy your meal. Here I have used sign of exclamation because I have said this with wonder. That's why I have used here exclamatory mark. A, thank you. B, can I get you anything else? A, no thanks. I would like the bill, please. B, that will be 250 taka only. A, here you are, keep the change. B, thank you. Have a good day. A, bye. I also can use here full stop, no problem. If I don't want to express owner, then I can use here full stop. Part two, English in the classroom. Dear learners, can I start part two? Okay, sir. All right, English in the classroom. I'm sorry, I'm late. If a student is late to come in the class, then he can say this, I'm sorry, I'm late. May I ask a question? Student will use this. May I ask a question? If a student wants to get permission from teacher while sharpening pencil, I mean, a student wants to sharpen her pencil, that time she can get the permission from teacher this way. May I sharpen my pencil, please, miss? This way, a student can ask, may I sharpen my pencil? What page is he, please? Student can use this expression. 
what pays is in please teacher also you can teacher also can use this expression while talking with the students what pays is in please how do you say it in english that means any bengali words or any bengali sentence you want to get the english of that bengali sentence into english then you can ask this expression to the student how do you say it in english or a student also can use this expression to teacher teacher i don't understand this bengali sentence i want to know the translation of this bengali sentence i want to know english of this bengali sentence how do you say it in english how do you say it in english student can take permission from the teacher this way may I go to the toilet please may I go to the washroom please i'm sorry i don't understand a student can stand up and he can say i'm sorry i don't understand if he doesn't understand anything then he can say this teacher i'm sorry i don't understand please make me understand make me clear can you repeat that please if a student wants to do anything again then he can or she can request his or her teacher using this expression can you repeat that please miss excuse me can you repeat that miss can you repeat that please this expression can be used between two students one student can use this expression to another one hey can i borrow your pen please can i borrow your pen please can i borrow your pencil please can i borrow your eraser please this way and this expression will be used between two students let's go forward a student is interested to clean the board then a student can say may i clean the board please miss i want to clean the board may i clean the board please please miss allow me to clean the board student will use this expression next expression teacher will use this expression with the students read listen and write read listen and write please work in pairs that means a teacher wants to get her work done by peer work then teacher will use this expression with the student please work in pairs if teacher wants to get her work done by the students in group then she will say please work in groups if the teacher wants to get her work done by the student in pairs then teacher will use this expression please work in pairs teacher will use this expression open your books on page 9 please open your books on page 9 please
Tell or not? Right, going forward. If teacher wants to get a student coming to the board, then teacher can use this expression. Come to the board, please. Come to the board, please. Come to the board, please. Clean the board, please. Be quiet, please. Students, keep silent. Keep quiet, please. Don't make a noise. Don't make sound. Be quiet, please. Very important expression, pack your things away, please. Pack your things away, please. Let's go forward. Part three. Here, learners, you all will learn how you will talk with the principal in English. English with the principal. Teacher and principal. Try to understand. Conversation is between teacher and principal. Teacher. Don't worry, sir. All the teachers are committed to perform their best. Let nature take its course. Principal, well, let's see. By the way, have you planned the trip for students, teacher? Yes, I have already had a word with all students. Majority favors a Nuhash Poli too. Not a bad idea. It's going to be fun. Have they informed their parents? Teacher, yes, most of them. Principal, great. Teacher, a few parents are asking to include them too. Principal, no, that's not possible. Students will feel uncomfortable. Teacher, that's what I said to them. I will practice this conversation with Tamanna. You will play the role of teacher and I will play the role of principal. Okay? Okay, sir. Start. Don't alter. All the teachers are committed to perform their best. Let nature take its course. Well, let's see. By the way, have you planned the trip for students? Yes, I have already had a work with all the students. Majority favors a uh, Nuhash Poli too. Not a bad idea. It's going to be fun. Have they informed their parents? Yes, most of them. Great. A few parents were asking to include them too. No, that's not possible. Students will feel uncomfortable. That's what I say to them. That's great. So, this is an important conversation between teacher and principal. This is a plan about going on a tour going on a trip. Teacher, don't worry, sir. All the teachers are committed to perform their best. Let nature take its course. Principal, well, let's see. By the way, have you planned the trip for students? Teacher, yes, I have already had a word with all the students. Majority favors the Nuhash Poli tour. Not a bad idea. It's going to be fun. Have they informed their parents? Principal.
not a bad idea. I have said this with ex with owner. That's why I have used here sign of exclamation. Teacher, yes, most of them. Principal, great. Teacher, a new parents, I mean, a few parents, F-E-W, a few parents, I mean, some of the parents, not all, some of the parents were asking, some of the parents were asking to include them too. A few parents were asking to include them too. Principal, no, that's not possible. Students will feel uncomfortable. That's what is said to them. <coughs> Hopefully, you all have copied the conversation between teacher and principal. Now, let's go forward. The rest portion, principal, please ensure that every student get permission from her parents. Have them sign the form and submit well before going on the trip. Teacher, sure sir, I have sent the forms to their parents. Principal, well done. The rest portion, I will practice with Reshmanas. Okay. Yes, sir. The conversation between teacher and principal, rest portion, I will practice with Reshmanat. Yes, sir. I will play the role of principal and you will play the role of teacher. Mm -hmm. Please ensure that every student gets permission from her parents. Mm -hmm. Have them sign the form and submit well before going on the trip. Thank you, sir. I have sent the forms to their to their parents. Well done. Sure, sir. Principal, please ensure that every student gets permission from her parents. Have them sign the form and submit well before going on her on the trip. Teacher, sure, sir. I have sent the forms to their parents. Well done. Today, in part three, we have learned a nice, I mean, an interesting conversation between a teacher and principal. Not only interesting, but also very much important that a teacher has to use with the principal. Part four, English with a guardian. Guardian and teacher. Conversation will be between guardian and teacher. Guardian, miss, I went through her workbook the other day. It's almost blank. Guardian is saying this with older. Miss, that means guardian is talking to teacher. Miss, I went through, that means I went through. I went through her workbook the other day. It's almost blank. <coughs> Teacher, oh, Irene, but every time I look, she's writing. How can that be? Guardian, there are only some funny sketches on here. Would you please keep a closer eye on her? Teacher, this is a bit embarrassing. Okay, I will be more sincere and I will keep a closer eye on her. This conversation, I will practice with Swarmishta Dash. Swarmishta Dash. I am drawing attention to Swarmishta Dash. This conversation, I will practice with you. I will play the role of guardian and you will play the role of teacher, okay? Okay, sir. Miss. I went through her workbook the other day. Here, her means my daughter. Okay, means I went through my daughter's workbook the other day. It's almost blank. Oh, Irene, but every time I look, she writes, how can that be? 
There are only some funny sketches on it. Would you please keep a closer eye on her? This is a bit embarrassing. Okay, I will be more sincere and I will keep a close eye on her. Okay, that means conversation is between guardian and teacher. Guardian is saying, Miss, I went through her workbook the other day. It's almost blank. It's almost blank. Guardian has said this with wonder. Teacher, oh, Irene, you're uh, talking about Irene, your daughter. But every time I look, she's writing. How can that be? Guardian, there are only some funny sketches on it. Would you please keep a closer eye on her? Teacher, this is a bit embarrassing. Okay, I'll be more sincere and, and I will keep a closer eye on her. So dear learner, dear learners, that's all for today. Thank you. Thank you, thank you sir. You're welcome.